because I did die once here um, you'll see it kind of cut and kind of screw up but not too big of a deal and as I like pretty much finished up this area I figured out how to do it without being seen at all so if I really wanted to I could have loaded back but I didn't manually save in a while and it auto saved halfway through this room and so it, it would have just been a hassle and I just said screw it it's not that big of a deal um, so go ahead I think I missed that guy once here who knows who but he knows nope I ate him which is always good you always want to hit your target and then the robot saw the downed guy so I went ahead and threw the EMP there let him blow up and there you go and then auto saves here and yeah I'm gonna just leave it at that um so let's see what else was going on in this um there's a couple people up on the balconies in this room which come down or they should come down I don't know if they all do though because I, I want to say that they all didn't but I, I don't know who knows nobody knows but I was just missing so much with these tranquilizer darts because um, again don't want to really make excuses but I didn't really play this game that much or I haven't really played that this game that much um, recently so I wasn't used to the sway of the um, rifle so I don't know but here I actually get shot at quite a lot from the people up on the balconies if I remember correctly unless that was when I died let's see no I think it's here I think yeah I almost died from the guy up on that balcony as you will see I'm did, did I hit him I think I hit him I don't know we'll see if he goes down later or not and I did get him and so here's how you sh probably should have done this room probably should just went straight for under here as soon as you got off the elevator because the two guys outside of the elevator are looking out towards the way I'm looking now and so they won't see you and the uh, robot just moves back and forth down this room and so all you gotta really be careful of are the people up above but honestly it wouldn't be that hard so if you're going for, for a full sneaky type where you don't even get seen that's how you can do it um, <clears throat> and then here, uh, I think I just bypass this guy. I think I just go, yeah, I just go straight up this ladder. Onto the next room that I almost die in a couple of times. Um, I get spotted and they come after me a couple of times as you'll see. Uh, but in this room there is a security hub that you go ahead and have the password for if you have some pocket secretary. I don't know which one or where you get it, but I go ahead, open the door, and deactivate the camera, which I'm pretty sure the camera would be in this room, which just has a bunch of ammo and whatnot. And I took all that stuff with me just for the, um, uh, what's it called? Um, so, so that I could sell it later on. Sorry, I was kind of, I was, I was looking at something else on my computer. And so, but I was still trying to commentate, and so I was losing track and thinking and reading, and didn't work out too well. And here, I almost get killed. I don't know who spotted me there, because as you see on the minimap, it says hostile, which means that someone saw me and was coming after me, but then they, or then they quickly changed their focus or something. I, I don't know exactly what happened, but it's all right with me, because I'm still alive here. Um... So this part, um, I probably could have just done it a little bit faster. Uh, I, I was just super cautious just because I did die in this room once before. And I didn't want to die again because I don't like dying in this game. It makes me mad. Oh, 
Jeez, cat. Oh my god, cat. Always gotta knock something over, don't you? You only... The only time you come up on my desk is when I'm doing commentaries. Why? Probably because she hears me talking and she thinks uh, I want to talk to her. And the reason why I'm looking at my map here is to see where exactly I have to go. And I have to go down two levels and then to an elevator. Um, and th that guy, this guy actually sees me as you will see. I thought he was going to stop between the crates and the wall. But he doesn't. He just keeps on walking right on by and spots me. I don't even think I take him down because I don't think I have um, enough. Yeah, I don't have enough energy to take him down. So I was kind of screwed here. But it all works out in the end anyway, so it's not too big of a deal. So he sees me and I just sprint it. Uh, get behind this uh, and popped a um, little health thing I don't know exactly what it's called but it's the thing that boosts your health so I did that and now there's sniper looking at me there's a camera right there and there's people moving on up so I was just like hmm uh, I could try and take all these guys out slowly but I decided just to take a run for it and go down these stairs and I think right here here they kind of lose track of me and they just kind of forget about me which I don't understand why they didn't just come down the stairs because if they did I was pretty much screwed if they went two people maybe um, not like right after each other like enough distance so that I couldn't do the double takedown but close enough so that after I do the takedown I can't run away but they don't and so I get to keep on going then you're pretty much there for here or something I don't know I just bypass this camera really quick get out of the way oh man and then I search these rooms uh, I think there's uh, what is it um I think just a pocket secretary in one of these rooms. Oh, and another health thing. So that helps. Really helps me out. And I think that's... Yeah, there's a secretary. Uh, go ahead and read it. And no um, codes or anything like that. So nothing really important for me. So go ahead. Go down this elevator. And now that I think of it... Eh, never mind, never mind. Never mind. So go down this elevator. Uh, this uh, I'm trying to think of. Yeah, this is pretty much right at the boss. I don't think there is even another enemy until the boss comes. Uh, the reason why I hid behind that was because I saw the lights turn on and I I was trying to remember if people came at me. But as you see, they don't. They just keep on going. And wow, now that I aren't on this part, I finally figured out how to get into that room. I was looking for like a vent back here. Like maybe I had to move a crate or something. But nope, I just had to go to the right instead of to the left. And I go back here just to make sure I didn't miss a vent. But, oh man, I feel dumb now. I feel dumb. Oh well, there's probably nothing really spectacular in there anyways. At least not yet. And well, I don't know. There, there might have been something pretty good here. But here's the boss. I actually skipped the cutscene here. If you really want to see it, let me know, and I can just upload the cutscene. Um, and here I actually use the barrels, which really helps on the higher difficulties, like I am here. But as you see, I was kind of failing with my throwing because I haven't really thrown that many objects in this game, so I miss them quite a lot with the uh what what are they called the containers or something whatever whatever you want to call them in but if you use the containers he's pretty easy to take out like i tried like five times without the containers and it just does not work he he takes way too much damage to just use containers or to just use uh bullets and whatnot 
Um, but with the containers, it really, really speeds up the process. You can do it without even shooting him at all. I end up shooting him, uh, I think, one, maybe two clips of, or, yeah, just one clip of the SMG. And then maybe a couple of shotgun bursts after I finish off the barrels that I had. And I went ahead and threw that EMP just because it stuns him. As you see, he's kind of flipping out, and I pushed the wrong button there. And I think I'm pretty much out of containers by now. I think I might have one or two more. Or maybe one more. I, I don't know. Uh, yeah, yeah. That one right there. I get off on him, I think. Hide behind that corner. But a camper. So, yep. Now I just go ahead and shoot him. As you see in here, I was hitting the wrong button. I was hitting the right mouse button instead of control because I just forgot what aiming was um, but here I thought he was about to kill me and I got so lucky there pop him twice with the shotgun and it's over and I'll, I'll let you guys watch this because I like this part and hold on don't die on me yet this boy scout's got a few questions to ask the one who called you Barrett. Who is he? Why is FEMA sending you after Seraph Industries? FEMA? <laughs> you think FEMA gives a rat's ass about some rinky dink biotech corporation's company secrets? <laughs> you got worse enemies than FEMA. Yeah, like who? Who? That would hurt really bad. <sighs> Alright, and so there's about, oh, or, forgot all about this. Ooh, so he almost kills me. Um, 